question is, are you going to see Godzilla minus one in the cinemas? Yes. Is it a theater experience? Yes. In Japan, it's already out, and the people have been spreading the word like a wildfire, saying this thing is not just a good Godzilla movie, not just a good monster movie, but it's probably one of the best movies of the year full stop. I like that. I like that a lot. But we've got to do fact of the day, page number 119, fact number three. There are at least 300 earthquakes a year in the UK, but only 11 people have ever died in one. Huh, that is kind of on theme, you know, because Japan, Godzilla is an earthquake that sort of wakes him. No, it's nuclear explosions. Nuclear explosions. That's what it is. Oh, see, I see. You need to learn more about this stuff, I don't but know. that's what it is. It's the Big Bang. All right. You don't want the Big Bang. You don't want Never it. want the Big Bang. No. But in this case, they got the Big Bang with Godzilla. Understandable. Nuclear Understandable. breath, atomic breath. So the UK is a pretty safe place to live compared to Japan, at least. They have a lot of problems with natural disasters, this type of shit. 11 people died, 300 earthquakes? That's not that bad. That's really good, actually, when you think about it. It could have been a lot worse. Hey, no original the comic hand. Yes, say. brother, we're going to be reacting to the final trailer for Godzilla minus one. This thing, instant classic. I'm feeling it. I'm getting that vibe off of the people. The people have been speaking. What have people been saying? They've been saying it's so good. And I hope, I hope when we watch it, we have that same feeling. Let's get to this trailer anyway. Let's go. <laughs> PTSD. Or was he dreaming of the future? Oh, interesting. <laughs> ご存知の you know, the scoring was really, really good. It smacked you in the face. I'm getting like a chill. I feel like my hands are shaking mm. a little bit. You almost look like you're crying, to be honest. Don't, it might just be the cold. It's a bit of the cold. It's also <laughs> a bit of this. The scoring, the actual delivery of these lines. I really like how they've only given us a minute. A minute, five seconds. Mm -hmm. We understand the concept of Godzilla to some extent. He's going to come. He's going to decimate, right? And hopefully humans prevail. But this is really giving us just a little bit of character, mm -hmm. which I think is all we need right now. We don't need too much. You don't want to give away everything. And that's the thing with monster movies. Generally, the human shit is just so bad. And you just want to focus on Godzilla. But I feel with this one, there's actually going to be decent story and character work with the humans, which is going to make Godzilla even more threatening and villainous in what he's doing. Well, yeah, because then there's going to be that juxtaposition between the monster and then the humanity, mm -hmm. and also directly after the war, everyone coming together to fight the monster. It's just shocking how this film has been made on the budget it's been made versus the Americanized Hollywood versions, which have 10 times the budget and are considerably worse than what this is probably going to be. The thing is, I think the reason is this is actually a Japanese production, mm. right? These people who are on this production, they care. They they want to show this story in the best way possible. They want to show Godzilla as this top tier monster level mm -hmm. character and also bring it back to a time that now was like 80 years ago. Right. Yeah, when you think about World War II, most people, young people, don't even have a concept of that. No, nah, people, silly, silly, stupid people now. No understanding as to what happened in the past. If you don't know your past, you're going to repeat it. But you shouldn't let the past actually shackle you. That's the thing as well. Really smart words. Hey, there. that's what it is. You should acknowledge it, appreciate it, and then move on from it. Yeah, I think so. Because otherwise you're just going to be uh, stuck in that mindset and that struggle. I see that. Even though you're centuries away from it. Yeah. Yeah, anyway, guys, if you did enjoy this video, please do like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel down there. If you didn't, if you didn't, Godzilla gonna come after you. You don't want that? No, do they want that? No. no. So just subscribe anyway to avoid that. I've been Narendra the Comment. I've been on She's Sensei. She's been on Sensei. You've been Grant. We'll see you next time. That's tomorrow. If you don't know, make a video every single day. Been doing it every day for over five years. No, sorry, over 2,000 days now. And we are stopping till we get 10,000 subscribers. So do subscribe. Pop back in tomorrow for some more quality. Shitty content. Splash tag never nor hitch. Side goes. Also bring the Pukwas. Pukwas means nonsense. Impin jubby. We also bring that. Bring a lot. Bring a little, do a lot, do a little, but we do indeed bring the quality shitty content on a daily basis. So see you tomorrow for more of the same, slightly different, but essentially the very same. Once more, see you then. Skadoosh. <laughs>
Oh, freaking psycho! I got 